The new Evergreen OM motor is shipped configured for 1075 RPM and counterclockwise rotation. In this configuration, the yellow wire is connected to the black wire on the piggyback terminal and the purple wires are connected together. For your convenience, there are connection notes located on the harness for RPM and rotation selection. For 825 RPM applications, disconnect the yellow wire from the black wire. For clockwise applications, disconnect the purple wires. The yellow and purple wires are built with insulated terminals. However, if they are disconnected, it's a good practice to insulate these terminals with tape. For AC applications, after the harness has been configured for your application, connect the black and white wires to the load side of the contactor using the pre-installed spade terminals. These wires can be connected to either pole on the load side of the contactor. For heat pump applications, after the harness has been configured for your application, connect the white wire to the defrost control where the PSC motor was connected. Follow the defrost board line voltage input back to the contactor. Connect the black wire to the opposite pole of the contactor on the load side. Connect the ground wire to earth ground. When the Evergreen OM motor receives line voltage power, it will turn on within five seconds and then ramp up to speed. As a former contractor, I can honestly admit that I occasionally installed a dual rotation outdoor fan motor set up for the wrong rotation. For most dual rotation motors, that would mean removing the shroud, again, to change rotation. On this motor, you can simply connect or reconnect the purple wires to correct that mistake.